we are ready to respond to any challenge that we meet while trying to develop or to deliver on the transforming agenda of CAR. Some of the commodities like maize, we have emergency pests like the fall army worm. Two years ago, it suddenly appeared from nowhere. And within a year, it's devastating maize across the continent. TAT needs to be ready to respond to such emergency situation. So the event of today is a fall army worm response workshop. We want to take on from talking, from planning to action. It's been in place for two years. We've all seen how much it can devastate maize. So all the gains that TAT can do on maize, all the yields that we can, we can come up with through improved varieties, through agronomic practices, it can all vanish if an emergency pest like the poor army worm is not content. So the meeting that we are having now is basically see how we can bring our minds together, try to see how we can tackle this menace of poor army worm and serve our maize. This program started a month ago in Southern Africa. Maize is a staple. The Southern African, the average Southern Africa cannot do without is Shima. So we started there, and then when everybody came together, we brought all the people who have been working on this space, who have developed options to see how they can tackle this space. But we're particularly excited that among the many integrated options, we have a product that can be used as a seed treatment for Genza Dua, developed by Syngenta. It is what inspires us to say, let's bring people together, see how we can treat the maize seed with this product, have it protected for the first 30 days, and then we can use the other integrated options to reduce the menace of false army worm. Okay. So the African Development Bank is behind the organization of this workshop, and basically they've brought partner countries from West and Central Africa to come and basically brief us on the action plan they have on the ground of false army worm. Thereafter, they will encourage them to come up with concrete action proposals where funds from some of the loan programs ongoing within the country can be redirected to address this emergency menace. The African Development Bank has some funds also to put into the program to make sure we stop all army work. It's particularly interesting of, uh, for us in TAD because we want to deliver on something that we can show tangible TAD is out to demonstrate and do business and to make sure we transform agriculture. And if we can resolve a menace like this, then we would have been successful. We're looking forward to the two-day meeting, and we hope at the end of the day, any partner from any country, when they go back, they have an action plan in order to overcome this fall uh, army worm devastation across maize and across sorghum within Africa. That is what we want to achieve at the end of the two days, being here in Yaoundé.